So here we go. <clears throat> Windows is uh, restarting. And it's been about 10 minutes. And the name is too long, so we have to shorten the name. Um, just call it Inside Tech. There you go. Press Next. Skip over the password. I'm going to skip over. Uh, I don't want to automatically update Windows. I'll put the pass key in later. Ask me that later. Most of us are in uh, Eastern Time. I'll go through a couple of the settings here, um, the reset and some to turn off. A couple of things you want to do up front. First setting you want to go to control panel. Going to change the category to a large. Scroll down, hit the user account, and you want to change the user account control settings. Um, and just turn this thing off all the way. Never notify. Or else you're going to have a Windows pop up left and right like this one here. And it gets annoying as hell after a while. Going to go to computer. I want to go to uh, my uh, disk uh, properties. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to hardware. Back to properties. Policy. Turn off Windows right cache buffer flushing. Blah blah blah. Press OK. Another important uh, aspect of this is um, changing these power settings. As you can see here, it's unbalanced. And we want to put that on more options. And for some reason, when Windows uh, goes to this for the first time, it's a little bit slow. But um, it will come up here in a second. You're going to hit this uh, Show Additional Plans. You're going to hit High Performance. And we're going to hit uh, Change Plan Settings. Gonna go to the advanced settings. Gonna go to hard disk. Turn off the hard disk. Never. You want that? You want to go to processor power management. Minimum processor state on battery. It's set for five percent. We're gonna jack this all the way up to max. So that it never runs on a slow setting. Maximum processor state, blah blah blah, we're good. Multimedia. It's optimized uh, for the video, which is supposed to be. That's good. Press OK. Um, turn display off. I'm going to go for 10 minutes on each. Okay, now it's high performance. Going to um, restart the computer here real quick. There's your RAID setup.
Okay, and that's pretty much it. You have to load all your drivers, and just remember that the uh, less you put in, the quicker it's going to run. Um, I only load the bare minimum. I don't load all the toys in there because it bogs down the machine. But I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. And any questions on setting up the RAID is zero. Uh, leave a comment and I'll try to uh, get back to you ASAP and help you out. Okay. Have a great day. This is Inside Tech.